Dental implants are today's standard of care for replacing missing teeth. And there's a number of ways to do it depending on everyone's individual case. It's not a cookie cutter approach. And depending upon how damaged the structure around your natural tooth is, it depends how things proceed. So for example, if you're gonna lose a tooth or multiple teeth, you might have to have buildup of the foundation, bone and gum, which we talked about. And then you get a nice, beautiful virgin site in which to place your implant. So that's kind of the more um, lengthy process. The other is um, you can actually take out your, your tooth that was fractured and can't be saved, but if the foundation is healthy, you can put an implant in right away as well. But both procedures are done right in the dental chair, dental freezing like you'd have any other dental procedure done. The discomfort level, and that's m most people's question, is almost the same or even better than like a filling or a root canal. So it's, it's a bit of a fear factor that people have when, oh my God, this is what you're going to do to me. It's not that uncomfortable at all. The main thing is bone, where the implant's going to be placed, has no nerves. So there's no pain if there's mm. no nerves. Right. So it's just the surrounding gum that has a little bit of discomfort around it mm. occasionally. But it's also very technique sensitive, so pain is really associated with the expertise of the clinician doing it. If you have a clinician placing a couple implants a year, you're not so you know slick at it as somebody mm. who places two or three a day.